Ages, part one. Hi, I'm Daniel Souza and welcome to Aptitude Academy. Today's topic is going to be on ages. In ages, problems usually revolve around two people. An example problem goes like this. Five years ago, a father was five times his son's age. Five years from now, the father is three times his son's age. What is the son's age? These problems can be solved very easily if you pay a little attention to the statements and form the correct base equation. From then on, it's just simple simplification. Let's start. All right, unless the problem is overly complicated, a simple rule will help you solve all the ages problems. Now, the base rule is always let the present age be x. Now, suppose this, you need a variable that says the age after y years, it will be x plus y, since it is in the future. In the past, they say y years ago. Then you will need to write x minus y. That's all you need to know. Let's start solving our first problem. Problem 1. Rajiv's age after 15 years will be 5 times his age 5 years back. What is the present age of Rajiv? Right, the first problem is a simple one. Let's assign. Rajiv's present age, let it be x. Alright, now, after 15 years, that's in the future. So, x plus 15. 5 years back is in the past. So, x minus 5. Now, the problem says that Rajiv's age after 15 years is 5 times his age 5 years back. So, if you write the equation, it's x plus 15 is 5 times his age 5 years back. So, it's x minus 5. It's a simple equation. Just solve it now. x plus 15 is equal to 5x minus 25. Now you x, take x aside and you get a 25 here. So it becomes 15 plus 25 is equal to 5x minus x, so that's 4x. So this is 40 is equal to 4x. Implies x is equal to 40 by 4. That is 10. So Rajiv's present age is 10 years. Alright, let's move on to the second problem. Problem 2. The product of the ages of Ankit and Nikita is 240. If twice the age of Nikita is more than Ankit's age by 4 years, what is Nikita's age? Now the second problem, let's assign the ages. They say that Ankit's and Nikita's ages product will give you 240. Let's assign Ankit's age is x. Nikita's age is y. They said that x into y will give you 240. Now but you see that y is actually equal to 240 by x. So let's simplify our sum right here and replace y by 240 by x. So we eliminate one variable. So we can write this as Nikita's age will be 240 by x. Now, the next statement says that twice of Nikita's age, that is 2 into 240 by x, is 4 more than Ankit's age. So 4 more than Ankit's age means what? If you remove Ankit's age from Nikita's age, you will be left with 4. So minus Ankit's age is equal to 4. Now let's simplify this equation. Alright, so this is 480. You take an x multiplied here, so minus x square upon x is equal to 4. So this will give you 480 minus x square is equal to 4x. So you take it all on one side, it becomes x square plus 4x minus 480 is equal to 0. Alright, now factorize this. All right, now so factorizing this will give you x square plus 24x minus 20x minus 480 is equal to 0. Now 24 minus 20 is 4 and 24 into 20 is 480. So if you take common x into x plus 24 minus 20 common here x minus 24. So your factors will be x minus 20 and x plus 24. So implies either x is equal to 20 or minus 24. Since it can't be minus 24 x is equal to 20. But they've asked you Nikita's age. And Nikita's age is what? 240 by x. So it implies it is 240 divided by 20. 12 years. Hence Nikita's age is 12 years. Right, so this is part 1 on the lecture on ages. In my second video, I'll solve many more tougher problems. If you liked this video and found it helpful, do subscribe to my channel and like this video. I'd also appreciate it if you share this link on Facebook and told your friends about it. Thank you. Do subscribe to my channel and check out my link for more aptitude resources. Thank you.